Right, good afternoon people, this is Steve, the programmer again, the apparent programmer. I think I should change my name to apparent programmer. Anyway, let's get to it people. So, today is the doom day. The doom day. Yes, it is coming. So, as most of you have seen, most of you, maybe some, none, who knows. So, let me go to my doom file. So, we're going to open the file, select folder which I've already created, okay? Boom. You will now see many, many many files okay so we have um, obviously the main kaboom okay yeah so this is doom the game now most of this if not 90 of this um, it was a step by step with another youtuber and I literally went step by step um, going through this and it didn't did it take long it did it did I won't lie it took quite a while um, so you can pick these up off GitHub, you go on my GitHub um, and grab all the um, files and download and then play around with it yourself. So the main thing is, when you do run this one, you have to have it all open. So have everything in the same folder as you can see here, okay? Then what you need to do is you run everything from the main file, okay? So this is the main. Now I'm not going to go into all of the what, this, that, and the other. Let me just clear that down so it tidies it up. Uh, I'm not going to go into all of what everything means uh, because we'll be here for hours just like the guy was on the other YouTube. So, main things are, so it's to simplify what these files are and as you can see right at the top we're importing every single one of these files so import. Fire game is PG, okay, uh, but this one so from settings import, so that's a file in settings we're importing it. Raycasting file, object renderer file, so all of these files in your main one you're importing it okay so this is how you run any game okay so on the map file you can see how you can create a single map so number ones so then you can texture number ones in different colors numbers so then you can itemize what wall that is and then what sort of texture you want on it etc and then all your spaces here well they're just like walk around space okay so this is one level okay now what you can then do so you've got NPCs, so these are different ones, so your soldier, your caco demon, an exception, cyber demon. Then you've got your handlers, uh, rendering, um, yeah, I mean, seriously, you're going to have to watch the whole thing if you want to with the other, um, because I'm literally, it would take me far too long. Uh, I rabbit too much, so to try and explain all of this would just take forever. Um, but the one that you want to go to, so to play around with this game, so I found that the players were far too fast, okay? They were just at you, like within two milliseconds. So that's no good. Um, so you can literally, if I scroll to the top, you see how much code there is in this. So NPC, okay? Um, so look, you see, speed, you can adjust them. So technically you can cheat this game. <laughs> I've put it back up to two because I took it like a one and like they, they won't even move it. <laughs> I completed this so fast. So. All of that being said, so here are all the visibles, and you can play around with it. So in, for example, screenshots there, not the screenshots, sorry, resources. So here's all your sound files. Um, here's a lot of NPC stuff, like there's the demon, yeah, and then attack, and then the pictures, exactly all of it. But you could actually change all this. It's just simple, really. All you have to do is, because all the code's in, so you can change your pictures. Hey, you might have a family member in there that you can blast away. Yeah, so. This is what I'm going to be doing later on. So, go to the main file. We're now going to run the main file. And, I mean, seriously, people, how awesome is that? Can I turn that up? I don't know if you can hear that properly, but we are now doing it. I mean, this is awesome. So, you can change pretty much whatever. See, that slows down. And you can see from my health at the top, it's going up. Now you can fiddle around with this, you can give yourself 200 health. You can close the game. You can close the game. And generating health. Look, 88, 89C. I've even speeded up uh, on the top left how quickly I <laughs> reheal. I know. Now there's me. Now because you can't get away from them because of the importer, I let him die. But yes, this is the game, and then it will just start again. But if I come out of that, you can literally have so much fun with this. As in, 
then going on that, making another map. So once you do get right past all of these dudes, uh, make another one, and then that's it. And then it will just roll on to the next and roll on to the next, and then you can have different levels. So yes, there is a very quick snip, pip, snippity pip of the most awesome game ever that you can create yourself. Have fun, people. Thank <laughs> you.